Oklahoma State did not live up to the expectations of their coach Mike Gundy despite a resounding 59 points against Lamar. J.W. Walsh had a few design runs, but right here you see a broken play as Walsh ran all over the place just to pick up a meager amount of yardage. Our guys played okay. Um, we, were, we were a little sluggish and uh, maybe even sloppy at times. Uh, offensively, we were pretty average. Uh, defense got going after the first drive. Um, you know, it was tough for our players to get motivated at halftime, I'll be honest with you. Um, but, uh, but they did okay. I was proud of them. Uh, it's, you know, it's a good win for us. Uh, we weren't very sharp throwing the football. Uh, we did make some good catches. Coming back in from halftime in a game full of discrepancies, Mike Gundy found pleasure in the improvement he got in the return game. Junior wideout Josh Stewart returned a punt 67 yards for a touchdown early in the second half. I thought we improved some in our, uh, in our return game. We, we've worked uh, considerably in our return game, and uh, it, it, it benefited us tonight. I think, you know, obviously Josh uh, made a couple of players miss, but in most returns for touchdowns, that's what happens. Uh, those good players make guys miss in space. Stewart wasn't done there yet, as later in the game he would make catch after catch, including this spectacular diving catch from J.W. Walsh. The wideout certainly earned the game ball, the final score was Oklahoma State 59, Lamar 3. The Cowboys will have two weeks to make adjustments before opening up conference play in Morgantown as they take on the West Virginia Mountaineers. For Orange Nation Sports, I'm Richard Denson.